Hello, car enthusiasts. Now I love my vehicles, whether it's a lorry, a motorbike, or even a bicycle. But one thing they all have in common is they need a bit of TLC every now and then. Just like you wouldn't go months without an oil change for your motorbike, you shouldn't neglect your car either. Basic car maintenance is dead important, not just for keeping your car ticking over nicely, but for your own safety too. In this video, we're going to get stuck into some right useful tips from changing your oil to understanding those flashing lights on your dashboard. We'll even have a go at fixing a dent or two. By the end of this, you'll be well on your way to becoming a bit of a car guru yourself. Right, first up, let's get our hands dirty with an oil change. It's not as hard as you might think. You'll need a wrench, a drain pan, and some fresh oil, of course. Locate your car's oil drain plug, usually underneath, and unscrew it carefully. Let the old oil drain completely before replacing the plug and adding the new oil. Now for the brakes. Worn brake pads can be right dodgy, so it's crucial to keep an eye on them. You'll need a jack, a wrench, and new brake pads. Jack up the car, remove the wheel, then use the wrench to remove the caliper and the old brake pads. Slide in the new pads, reassemble everything, and you're good to go. Ever had a light flashing on your dashboard and wondered what the heck it meant? Don't worry, we've all been there. Some common ones are the engine warning light, which could mean anything from a loose petrol cap to a serious engine problem. Then there's the oil pressure warning, indicating low oil pressure, and the battery warning light, which might mean your battery is on its last legs. If your battery is flat as a pancake, you'll need to replace it. First, disconnect the negative terminal, then the positive. Remove the old battery, put the new one in its place, and reconnect the terminals. Positive first, then negative. Easy peasy. Tires are your car's only contact with the road, so they're pretty darn important. Check your tire pressure regularly and keep an eye on the tread depth. If they're looking a bit bald, it's time for new ones. And remember to rotate your tires every so often for even wear. Now, nobody likes a dinged up car. For minor dents, you can try using a plunger or a hairdryer and compressed air. For scratches, there are special rubbing compounds that can work wonders. Just remember, it's all about patience and a steady hand. Winter can be harsh on your car. Make sure your antifreeze is topped up, your battery is in good nick, and your tires have enough tread. It's also a good idea to give your car a good wash and wax to protect it from the salt and grime. Getting a flat tire is a right pain, but don't panic. Find a safe place to pull over, get your jack, wrench and spare tire out. Jack up the car, remove the flat tire, put on the spare, lower the car and tighten the nuts. You'll be back on the road in no time. The cooling system keeps your engine from overheating. Check your coolant levels regularly and top up if needed. If your car is overheating, it could be a sign of a leak or a problem with the radiator. Regular checks are key to keeping your car running smoothly. Check your oil level with the dipstick, your tire pressure with a gauge, and top up your fluids like washer fluid and brake fluid. It only takes a few minutes and can save you a lot of hassle in the long run. So, there you have it. A few basic car maintenance tips to keep you motoring. Remember, looking after your car not only saves you money, but also keeps you safe on the road. If you found these tips helpful, don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more useful car maintenance advice. We'll be back with more in-depth guides and tutorials, so stay tuned. 
Thanks for watching and drive safely.